hello my friends and welcome to my channel in this video I'm going to draw and repaint a painting from Edgar Degas which is perfect for drawing or repainting and as usual I start with drawing with pencil and then move to uh, drawing with ink or watercolor and at the end I'm going to add some uh, colors to my painting My brush is number 20 or 50 and it depends on the brand, which brand you are using because it is differences between um, 20 or 40 in some brands with the other and uh, when you are practicing more you will be more capable to use tiny or more elegant brushes but in this uh, paper that I'm using, it's really hard uh, to move smoothly with my brush because this paper is um, appropriate for watercolor. And on the other hand, some in some painting, I prefer to use just ordinary paper like A4 and don't use uh, these kind of um, papers that are uh, usable for watercolor but now because I'm gonna use a watercolor at the end so I decided to use up this paper the real painting that is from Edgar Degas is painted with uh, chalky pastel and this is perfect as you see at the beginning of the video or at the um, thumbnail of my video uh, this painting is perfect but I prefer to just repaint or redraw this with ink and somehow make it more simple for myself or for the other person who are interested in painting but they are not too much expert on painting and as you see my channel and the other videos that are in my channel I'm sharing with you uh, those videos are all with ink and they are focused in lines and the quality of lines so I decided to choose uh, another painting from another artist in the history and when I was searching on the internet I found this painting so I was in love from the first uh, with this painting and I decided to add more colors in my drawing also it, it is a drawing but I prefer to it be more colorful so I used of my colors green color to change the mood of this drawing and make it better so I'm going to use this green in uh, the background of my drawing so you can add any kind of color that you are interested in this and uh, you love this but I decided to use of this green because I found this a little balancing between my drawing and something that I want it to be furthermore adding more details and shadows to the clothes and the other part of the painting makes it uh, more interesting and kind of um, close to the real painting so I just use a little shadows in somehow in some part of my painting and I think that's enough for the shadows and let's move to the other part which is adding the other color to my drawing and and before this for the face I just add some details and some dark colors to make it more real 
we are about to finish this painting. I hope you enjoyed watching this and please subscribe my channel to watch and see more videos. Thank you.